In this video, I am going to show you how you can add timers to my slides using either Google Slides or PowerPoint. So I'm gonna start by just downloading one of my slides. I'm gonna do the plant themed ones because right now this is my most recent, but this will work with any of my 30 plus slides. So I'm going to download this first. And then once it is downloaded, I am going to choose one of the files. So you can choose any. I'm just going to go with the um, no timers just because then uh, I have nothing to work around and they're blank. If there are timers, you can also, and you're not wanting them to transfer over, I guess, you can also just click and delete them. Um, but for the simplicity, I'm just gonna use the blank ones. So here are the no timer slides. Now to add a timer of choice, say that you want something different than the ones included, which are the 30, 20, 15, 10, five, and the gradient. If you're wanting say like 50 minutes, here's how you're gonna do it. Or if you're just wanting to convert it to Google Slides. So I'm gonna go to my Google Slides. I am going to add a blank presentation. And what I'm going to do first is go to File and Import Slides. So once you're here, you are going to go upload the slides I was just showing you. So you can also drag them. I'm gonna do the no timer plant slides and open. And then this will upload the slides to Google, to Google Slides. Now, since these are all blank with no timers. I'm gonna show you once they're uploaded how I'm gonna add in the timers. But first it's going to have me pick the slides to import. So again, you could just choose certain slides that you want, like if you only want good afternoon or good morning. Um, I'm just gonna click all of them to just kind of show you how it's going to look once I import them all. Um, and then you're gonna put import slides and it will convert it. I'm going to delete this page because there's nothing on it. Um, it looks kind of stretched out. And usually if you close out and then go back in, I've noticed that it has fixed it. So that they're not stretched out like that. Okay, so now how to add the timers. I am going to go to insert and then video. And then in here, you can type however long you want. So let's just say I want 50 minutes. I'm just going to put 50 minute timer and search. So you can pick from any of these. Some might have buzzers, some might not, um, but pick whatever one's going to suit your classroom. So I'm just going to select this one and then it will insert it. And then I can adjust it here to fit whatever size I'm wanting and I can move it to where I would like. And then um, you could either click it here and it will start. Or what I always do is I'll go into up here into the presentation mode. And then let's say I had this filled out. When the kids come in or when I want it to go, I just click the play button and the timer, whoops, I went back. Click the play and the timer will start. So again, you could choose any amount of time then for this. And if you're wanting the 50 minute timer also with the PowerPoint, I'm gonna show you how to do that. Um, one way you could do it is um, I am right clicking on this video and then I'm gonna put copy video URL. And then I'm gonna go over to PowerPoint. So here I have them on PowerPoint. Again, these are the no timer ones. And I'm going to go insert and then to video and then you will go to online movie and then I will paste this and then this will insert that exact same video but on PowerPoint so again I can adjust it and then I will go down here to presentation mode and again same thing I will click play and it will count down for me so this is the way that you can get timers to fit your need if they are not already um, time the times that you would use in your classroom. So super quick and easy and easy to import to Google Slides and have timers there. Thanks for watching.